Lately, I got some inquiries about the example of controlling EWA from VRAB using the Google Sunrise Toolbox. In this tutorial, I am going to elaborate on this example. So in this example, we have Kuka EWA robot and external VC. The external VC runs MATLAB and runs VRAP. MATLAB connects to the robot through the Kuka Sunrise toolbox. Also MATLAB connects to the VRAP scene through the remote ABI DLL library. So first of all, I am going to be explaining the VRAP scene for people who doesn't have a background about VRAP. So here I have the VRAP scene on my screen. At the left in here we have the scene hierarchy. So in here we have the robot, the joints of the robot, first, second, third joint, fourth joint, fifth, sixth, seventh joint. So between the joints we have the links. You see that we have two objects. One is visible, the other one is not visible. So, the link is here, and this is like a collider around the link. It's used by VRAP for collision detection or for path planning. Also, in the scene hierarchy, you can see the path. So, this is the path. So, this path has been constructed offline in VRAP. Now to construct a path, you click here on the path and then you click on this button in here. And here you see the path. This path has seven different points. I chose the path to be closed. So it's going to connect the first and the last points together. So I'm going to close it. So after cons constructing the path, you need a point that is moving on the path. And this point is following the parent path. So, to define a path in VRAP, you need to define the points of the path and you need a dummy that is going to move on the path. This dummy shall be linked to the parent path. So, you shall put the dummy under the path and then you double click the dummy and you check this box in here that says follow parent path. Then afterwards you have to add a script that controls the path. So in our example here, the motion of the dummy of, on the path, the velocity of the motion of the dummy on the path is controlled from MATLAB through the remote ABI. As such, in VRAP, you have to do the following. 